guys, so I changed my background, like I kind of feel like I'm changing it all the time but it just kind of depends where the lighting is better and I just felt like filming with natural lights today so let's just hope that the sun doesn't go away too fast or too... I don't, I don't know what I'm saying, okay, whatever, the lighting was better so that's kind of why I'm filming this way but today I'm going to be talking about what's in my bag and I'm, I've been seriously obsessed with these videos so much like I've been watching them non-stop so I thought it was only appropriate to watch them if I show you guys what was in mine so that's what I'm doing today and here is my bag um I will put a link to this bag and like the like what kind of bag it is and stuff like that the color and stuff if I find it online down below if you guys are interested but it kind of looks like this big like shopper bag and you can kind of make it bigger or smaller with the little zippers on the side so this kind of makes it bigger and then I regularly just like keep it zipped up because I don't know I don't like it to be he too heavy and I feel like if the bag is smaller then it's not gonna be as heavy I, I, I don't know so this is what it looks like and it just has like one this one gigantic pocket with like two little you guys can't really see that, can you? With like two little pockets, pockets, pockets here. So, on start out with those little pockets. Um, the only thing that I literally have in here are some mints. These are just like mints, kind of, yeah. And also something that I really like about this bag is that it has like this little pocket mark mirror that tied here, so you can just look at yourself and see how you look during the day. Then I have this black folder sort of thing. I don't usually like to carry on like the big files, so I'd rather have this with me. So that's why I have this black little thing and then some papers in it. Then I've got my agenda that is again black. And I really like the fact that it has like one page for the whole day because sometimes I have a lot of homework and it just doesn't fit. And then I've got my pencil case that is again very colorful. Um, it's kind of like leather and yeah, one small zip here, one big zip here. I'm just like one of those people who like start up the school year with like full on pencil case and then like ends up with like two pens. Just yeah. And then I've got uh, my wallet that is black. I mean, I pretty much have everything in black. And this is from Celine and. Just open it up, you have places to put two cards here, of course, debit card and Starbucks card. Then in here I've got some receipts and also I've got we've got like these little cards um, that we use to get meals in school if you want to eat in school. And then the little zipper thingy where I keep my change. Then I've got some more places to put some cards here. And then I usually have money here, but apparently I don't. So that's cool. Then I've got the book that, oh, earbuds, because I mean I like my earbuds and I like that they're not too big so they kind of go anywhere with me. Then I've got the book that we're reading in English that is about a town called Canary Row and it's like a very socialist book which I like. Um, it looks like a child's book which it probably is but like it has a deep meaning behind it which I really like also. Then. I've got my home keys that are with this little bear here that wears a t-shirt with England flag on it and I like it. Apparently I like it because I have it. Um, then I've got the book that we'll read in German which I have no freaking idea about. But this is how it looks like. I like, it. like German is not my thing. Water bottle because you can never be too much hydrated unless you drink like a lot and you die. But then I normally drink like this much in an hour and a half or so so I fill it up every hour and a half and at least I try to then I got my makeup bag which I feel like is the most interesting part so I'm sorry I still got my mint in my mouth and this is how it looks like like this hasn't changed from last year the good things in it has changed but like regularly this is this was makeup bag that I was carrying it has two major pockets and then one smaller pocket um, I have like five like, products in here so I'm just gonna start out with them I've got this much of products in my bag why? I don't know, don't ask, I just, I just do so the first one is my ultimate favorite and it is the Laura Mercier lipstick in baby lips this is super super natural and I just 
I'm just obsessed with it. It is also very, very high rating, which is great to have in school because I don't know, I get chapsticks like super, super quickly and it, it just really bothers me. Then I got a like more of like a color like BAM thing. If I was wearing a statement like lips or so, this is the one with, that I'll continue with throughout the day. And this is the Rimmel Kate lipstick in 109, which looks like this, and I like it. And it's like perfect for the fall time. Then I got this one, and this is the Bourjois Color Boost in Plum Russian. Again, a very like statement color, but this is really, really moisturizing and a little more sheer than the other one. Then I've got my Rimmel, just no, Revlon Just Bidden Kissable lip balm, and this one is in the color Honey. It was given to me by Celine, which I am I am obsessed with here. Thank you so much. I am obsessed with this lip product. It is like the best like moisturizing natural lip color that I like I will ever have. Then I got two lip balms. I've actually got the third one, but like in my pencil case because like I sometimes don't take my bag everywhere, but my pencil case is always with me, so I moisturize my lips with that. Okay. Whatever. I've got the um L'Occitane lip balm that is this little like push on little things that moisturize your lips it's kind of like a gloss and this one looks like a real lip balm and this is the i love i love i love raspberry and blackberry which has a little heart on it which i think is super adorable so i used it one and this one smells really good too then i've got a hand sanitizer that is from bath and Works, and it is the berry paris smells really good i don't really recommend it wearing in class because like the smell is a little too overwhelming, especially in all of the Bath and Body body products. So definitely like wear it outside or when you're done with class at least. Pocket mirror that is from Forever 21. It's just like this double um, pocket mirror thingy. I like it. And it has little flowers on it and it says Wild Child. Then I've got two roll-on perfumes. One of them is Taylor by Taylor Swift. This smells so fresh and if you guys have not smelled this one yet definitely go ahead and give it a try and the second one is the one that i like a little less and it is black by zara i feel like it has a little like i don't know it feels too womany in some ways so i don't really like it but this one is definitely like on the cheaper side and then i've got the concealer that i literally never use but you never know when you're gonna get used or out of this and this is the boeing Benefits concealer that I've like trimmed this like hit pan on it But I still keep it in here And last but not least I've got the Catrice I mean yeah kind of the least because I don't really use that one either And um, this is the Catrice modifying oil control paper I don't really get oily skin but if I did I mean I'd have these they're not like the best of the best of the best But they're still good so You know it definitely depends on how oily your skin is, I guess. And I don't really use it unless my skin is like super oily and then like it just doesn't do it. So yeah, that was everything that was in my bag. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Give this video a big old thumbs up if you did and I'll talk to you guys in my next video.